Hello guys, my name is Siddharth Varde and uh, this is like uh, Unity Fundamentals 1, MAT 1, uh, the project. So uh, in this project, like I created an uh, local, uh, yes, local multiplayer, uh, 2D snake games with the local multiplayer features. So uh, like uh, here are the main functionality. So like first of all, the player functionality comes, they can move and uh, like change direction of uh, move. Yes, change the direction of movement. Then, uh, like the snake would wrap around the sc uh, screen, so it would uh, go out from one side of the screen and uh, come in from the an another side. Then, there are, like there are a few power ups and a uh, few different types of food that uh, that will spawn in the level and uh, play and eat, uh, like player can eat them. Uh, then, uh, like it has, uh, as I said, it's a local multiplayer system. So there would be two snakes and uh, they would both compete with each other. So if uh, snake A bites snake B, then snake A wins. And uh, if snake B bites snake A, then uh, uh, snake A, uh, sorry, yeah, snake B will win. Okay. Then uh, there is a scoring system. So uh, like the more food you eat, uh, you get more scores. And uh, uh, if you like, as you said, if you eat burner, then you uh, lose the score. Then like there is a basic UI so like main menu screen, pause menu and uh, game win or game uh, game loop, uh, sorry not game lose but like game win and who won and uh, then uh, restart button and stuff. So uh, and uh, okay so screen wrapping, uh, wrapping functionality. Uh, what I did like I uh, I used uh, dynamic screen wrapping. So uh, like I calculated the end of the screens. Uh, through the scripting in the start method so and uh, I use a singleton pattern for that uh, and to, to, to retrieve that data so just a minute I will show you the code so uh, yes this is the where I take the end of the boundaries so like the bottom left position and then bottom right position then uh, to, uh, top left uh, top left position and top right position so those positions and then I calculate uh, like the real world data like x position and y position and it's a single run pattern as you can see so I will be able to retrieve this data uh, in other classes uh, directly so, okay so let me show you the gameplay Okay, so that makes sense, and uh, I say play, and yes, so uh, I can move first character with WASD and like this is a shield power up and I can move the another character with uh, right arrow keys so I uh, like player two uh, beat the player one so he wins that's the kind of thing and then we can say like main menu and uh, quit and stuff so this was the gameplay uh, thank you